So we're going to go and take some real quick par measurements here on the Lagoon um, Innovative Marine 25 gallon. So got the Senai set up. Here's the tank. What's on here is two AI Prime HDs set to the Ecotech AB um, setup on the lights. So I did go and make some checks just before I started this video, and yeah, I can tell you they're pretty high right now. So I'll be adjusting those um, once I get a chance here. So let me just move this camera here so you guys can see power readings uh, just around the tank here this is going to be front sand bed <clears throat> jumping up around 212, 215 uh, with the par sitting around 75, 76%. Uh, moving up midway on the front. Uh, still looking around 183, 220. Uh, yeah, it looks like it's gonna be 220 on the peak. Um, per is at now 79%, so a little bit more. This is gonna be right above the clam. Um, that should be up front also too. So we're still pushing around 190. Yeah, back down the same amount of uh, per as before on the sand bed. Now here's gonna be where the numbers get really sky high. This is gonna be near the surface, probably about inch and a half, two inches underneath the surface. Right underneath the light here. Okay, and that's close to being underneath the surface. I'm going to show you guys. We got 402 as the max right now. So I'm going to turn this back. Okay, so right where I got all my SPS, I'm going to go right in the middle of all that. And that's 251. Back again with the same amount of per, so it seems like it's um, the per isn't that it doesn't fluctuate too bad. But this is going to be on the let's say right side of the rock structure here. Uh, about 100 par, so it does drop off. I have to take a measurement to see how far off the surface I have these lights. Um, I'm going to say probably more than 10 inches off the surface. But it's on the left side, right underneath between both of the lights themselves. You can see we're getting much higher readings there. Be careful while I'm moving around, I want to start. Dragon SPS corals. It's going to be on the back left hand side uh, where I'm actually thinking of probably getting like a sun coral or something to put back there. Kind of figured it was going to be low par. And down on the sand bay where the mushrooms were at. So that's left front of the left AI. Um, yeah, 126, looks like it's jumping around there, 78 on the per. So, looks like we're doing good. It's going to be middle, bottom sand bed, down where I have my lobos at. That's a little bit too high for what I would like, but again, I know already it's, the lights are probably up too high. Um, so I'll probably have to play around with those settings there. I may just leave them depending on how much growth I get, so it, it really does depend uh, on what I see here in the next couple of days. These corals did come from out of my main display, 
um, which I am pushing around maybe 400 at the surface where most of them were hanging out on the frag rack. So, get that back. So they, they're pretty used to high par. Uh, but I'll try to probably make some adjustments here because I'm going to be doing T5s on this also. So I don't want to go cooking everything. But, yeah. That, I'm just going to leave it on the sand bed. Show you guys here. So that was getting around 91, 91 par. Again, this is the Innovative Marine uh, 25 gallon. Just did a quick par reading on the two AI primes. Um, again, set to the Ecotech AB um, settings. I'll try to get a screenshot of what they look like, but they're pretty much the same ones that BRS did a video on a couple couple months ago. So if you guys either um, want to check their video out in regards to that, I'll see if I can get that link put in the description. Um, but other than that, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, just let me know if you guys got any questions. Want to see any other settings that you may guys that you guys may be running? Um, like I said before, I am going to be adding on uh, T5s to this, so it actually may just be one puck instead of two. Um, right now, I do have an AI Prime. I don't know if anybody saw it, but I do have an AI Prime. The the first gen, I would say, I, I would call it then, um, that is playing as a huge light right now. It's been doing pretty well, so I'll be posting a video on that um, also, too. Right now, there's a lot of micro bubbles. Um, I was treating the tank here and also got the skimmer going. So, lots and lots and lots of micro bubbles going on. Again, thanks for watching.